Hi guys! Uh, today I would like to tell you about my 23rd and 24th week of pregnancy. To remind you, I am pregnant with twin fraternal boys. In these two weeks, actually, I had more migraines. So I'm trying to find out what's triggering them. For now, I think uh, it might be sugar. Before pregnancy, I was not eating sugar almost at all. And obviously now, in second trimester, I gave up to my cravings. And I noticed that whenever I was eating more sugar, I was having more uh, migraines. So last week, I had three migraines uh, with aura, with flutters in my eyes, in within one week. So it's I was pretty miserable. <laughs> Those two weeks were pretty intensive. We had our um, ultrasound and OB follow-up. Everything is fine. Their weight is even a little bit ahead of schedule. So that's great. They turned now. Um, they, they were both head down, but now one is head up and second one is head down. So baby A is head down and baby B is head up. Uh, which means that I'm experiencing kicks all over my belly. Um, the other highlight of the of those two weeks was the child childbirth classes. It lasted from nine to three thirty, so for me it was pretty tiring experience. But um, it was interesting. We learned lots of things. Obviously, we made lots of notes and we received as well printed uh, notes to take home. Um, in my opinion, it should be divided into more classes because during one long course you can make notes, but you probably won't memorize lots of things because, because of the tiredness and, and the intensity of the course. So um, yeah, I think it should be divided into more classes. What we did there was a hospital tour, which was very interesting. It's good to know <laughs> where we are going to deliver. As well, we learned a couple of techniques how to cope with contractions. And I think that lots of the advices were focused on, on our partners, which is great because they have to keep strong during the whole delivery and they have to support us as well. <laughs> So this was fun. I will insert some clips from the from the childbirth classes um, into the video now. The surgeon guides the baby's head away from the pelvis and toward the surgical opening as an assistant applies pressure to the top of the uterus, which the mother might feel. Once the baby's head is out, the surgeon pulls the rest of the baby through the surgical opening and she is born. So we're gonna do some Kegels right now. Yes, I want you to tighten those muscles as tight as you can. Everybody, and release it. And you know what is a good thing about Kegels? Nobody can tell if you're doing it. <laughs> you don't have to squint. <laughs> you don't have to make faces, nothing. You just Kegel. You can even Kegel in church. Nobody knows. <laughs> Nobody knows. Okay, so let's, Where's labor and delivery? What floor is labor and delivery? Oh, hi. Five. Five. So let's do an elevator Kegel. So Kegel, elevator just Kegel. a teeny little bit on the first floor. And you're tightening it a little more on the second floor. And you're getting even tighter on the third floor. And really getting tight now on the fourth floor. And you're as tight as you can go on the fifth floor. Other things that happened within those two weeks is that we that we finally bought my parents flight tickets. So they are going to come uh, here from Poland, from Wrocław to Detroit at the end of August. So hopefully they'll be able to be here for the delivery. I hope boys won't be delivered before 38 week, fingers crossed. <laughs> Couple of days ago, I had to do my eye maintenance, <laughs> which means that I was crying for like one half an hour while watching Doc's Purpose. It's an amazing movie, just watch it. Whoever loves dogs will be probably crying as I did. From the medical point of my life, I got diabetes screening yesterday. It was terrible. The, the beverage is disgusting. I will show you how disgusting it was.
And as well, I received new vitamins. I'm going to take omega-3, um, CoQ10, um, magnesium, and uh, baby aspirin. The, the, the whole package is to try to help me with my migraines. Let's see, hope, hopefully it will help. I hope you enjoyed all those random facts about my two weeks of pregnancy and see you next week. Bye!